Before diving into the world of Security Operations Center, let us understand where do the SOC job fit in. Consider the entire job market where we have jobs for human resources, sales, accounting and various construction jobs. A considerable amount of jobs are in the area of information technology where people like developers, front-end developers, back-end developers, full-stack developers, test engineers work on various technologies like Python, Java, .NET, etc. In order to support these information technology roles, there are IT infrastructure jobs. Jobs like system engineer, network engineer, database engineer, cloud engineer, etc. A subset of IT infrastructure jobs are for IT security, which deals with protecting the digital assets of an organization. Here, job roles like endpoint security engineer, vulnerability assessment engineer, network security engineer, and IAM engineer exists. We have SOC jobs in the area of IT security who works on technologies like SIM, SOAR and threat intelligence. In order to be working in security operations center, it is important that we should understand all the associated job roles. Let's illustrate this with an example. Consider if one wants to be a successful civil engineer, he has to know how to work with an architect, a mason, a tile worker, a plumber, electrician and a painter. The civil engineer himself need not be expert in all these areas, but he needs to know how to work with them, how to communicate to them in order to get what he wants. In a similar way, when someone considers working in the area of SOC, as a security analyst or a SOC analyst using technologies like SIM, Threat Intel and SOAR, they have to know how to work with other IT security teams as well as IT infrastructure teams. Now you might be wondering what is this system engineer, who is this endpoint security engineer, who is the database engineer and what does a technology like SOAR mean? Don't you worry, the entire course is designed to help you understand these roles as well as the technologies. In the next module, we will look into how did so many job roles in the area of IT infrastructure and IT security evolved.